Join me and together we can destroy the Sith. Hey everyone, it's Kimmy the Clown. And guess where I just got back from? Disneyland! It was so magical, you guys. There were pumpkins everywhere. And I got to ride all the rides and meet all the princesses. It was so much fun. And while I was there, I picked up the brand new Star Wars Simpsons from Episode 2, Attack of the Clones. I can't wait to show them to you guys. But before I do, I also picked up a surprise souvenir. So I'm going to show that to you first. It's a Series 6 Star Wars Vinyl Nation. These are so exclusive because they're only available at Disney Parks. This box contains one of seven known designs or the elusive mystery chaser from the Star Wars Series 6 collection. Which one did you get? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see which one I got. Let's open it up and find out. Oh my gosh, okay, let's open it. Ooh, it's in a bag. All right, let's see what I got. Oh, it's Tebow the Ewok. Wow, he looks just like how he looked in Return of the Jedi. And I love that they made his Mickey Mouse ears forest background. Very cute. All right, and now for our Star Wars Episode 2 Zoom Zooms. The first one I got is Anakin Skywalker. Yep, looks just like Anakin. And this is even the haircut he's got in Attack of the Clones. With the short hair on top and the Padawan braid on the side. He's wearing his Jedi robes and he's even got his blue lightsaber. I don't like sand. It gets everywhere. And next there's Count Dooku. Also known as Dark Tyrannus. Wow, he sure does look mean. Maybe he didn't like the drive home from Disneyland. He's got his white hair and his white beard, and he's really looking like a Sith with his cape. But if you lift it up, he's got his signature curved handled lightsaber. Join me and together we can destroy the Sith. And next there's Ayla Sakura. She helped the Jedi's fight on the Battle of Geonosis. She's got her long blue twilight ears and her brownish gray headband that matches her clothes. And of course, a blue lightsaber. And this one is Padme Amidala. Her hair's up in a little bun and she's even wearing her battle gear with the cape that she wears on Geonosis. You're not all powerful, Annie. Well, I should be. Ooh, look, this one is Plu Koon. He's got his orange alien face and his little mask down at the bottom. And he's wearing his Jedi robe with the hood on. And there's his blue lightsaber. He was always one of my favorite members of the Jedi Council. And now we've got Mace Windu. The stern but powerful Jedi himself. He's got his bald head and he's wearing his Jedi robes with his famous purple lightsaber. Nice of you to join us. This party's over. And last but not least, we have Jango Fett. This bounty hunter means business. He's got his blue mask with the antenna on the side, and he's even wearing his utility belt with his jet pack on. I'm just a simple man trying to make my way in the universe. 